In other words, if I have like a trig function and I say sine of 180 degrees, right? And then I see that the answer is not quite what it should be. What I would do is maybe I'm in the wrong mode. So if I hit the mode button, I see that I'm not in degree mode. I'm actually in radian mode. So I use the cursors and wait till degree is highlighted and then hit enter. Then I hit second mode to quit. Now if I hit entry again, it'll automatically enter it in. And we know that sine of 180 degrees is actually um, zero. Now, if I were to take sine of say pi, that should also be zero if we are in radian mode because pi is um, the radian measure for 180 degrees. And so I see here that it should be zero, but it's not. So again, if I hit mode, scroll down to radian, then hit enter, second mode to quit, hit enter again, and that's how you switch from degree to radian.